What is up everyone? It's me, Sivo, and in today's video, I'm going to be teaching you how to do drop downs. So basically a drop down is you click it and as a drop down, I'll basically show you to actually get a better understanding of what it is. I'm going to try to show you the easiest way possible on how to do it. So before we get started, make sure you drop a like and subscribe because that will help me massively. And yeah, so let's go. So we're going to be using a, a class as this would keep it neat and tidy and less messy if we was going to put it in just a command. So before we start, make sure you do from discord.ui import select and view and then from uh, and then just, you know, the commands and all that. So yeah, anyways, let's get started. So first we're going to do app, um, not app. We're gonna do we're gonna make a class so we're gonna make a class is called let's just call it my select and then we're gonna put a view in it and then we're gonna do at discord oh crap discord dot ui dot select and then um we're just going to uh make a few light like, things so first we're gonna do a placeholder so what a placeholder is is the what it says in the selector bar so we're gonna just put choose uh choose um choose an option choose an option just like that and then um we're gonna have options so the options will be we're gonna put this in an array so just put an array or a list it looks we're using python and then we're gonna just oh crap not custom ID. and just click enter and then we're gonna do um uh, okay so do discord dot select option and then we're just gonna put in a label and this is what it's going to be called and we're just going to put in let's just do we're going to i'm going to show you how you edit and all that just like the button videos so if you haven't seen the button video you can go and watch that uh, i did forget to put a capital v so make sure it's a view like the one up here so the label is going to be let's just do an edited embed and then we're going to have a value you don't have to do these values you can also just use the label as the value but this will just make it a little bit easier for us. So for this value, we're just going to have one. So basically think of a value as an ID. All right, description. And we're just going to put um, this. This is a edited embed. And then that's literally all you have to do to make a select option. Now, if we just um, put a comma here and we copy this, we're going to do three of them. So we're going to go bang, bang, just like that. And the second one we're going to do is an edited message. And then we're going to put a value of two and then uh, we're going to put this is a edited uh, message then the next one we're going to do is just a normal message so we just literally sent it down below so normal message you can also do a normal embed but we're going to do that id we'll do three this is a normal message okay and that's literally all you have to do for that and i think we are done on that now we need to do a callback so async def and then we can do select and call callback and then we're going to put uh, three things in this so we're going to put cell we're going to put select and we're going to put interruption okay and now we're going to do select dot disable um equal to true uh so basically if we if we make a a value what we go about the like get um and if we make it false then if you click it the select thing cancels out but why it's true it you can use it multiple times all right so if we do if select dot value um and then we're going to do zero as this is in the list of all of these um we're going to do if it's equal to the the id or the value the value id so one then we're going to do embed we're going to make an embed real quick so embed discord dot embed i'll quickly speed run this uh, i don't really care about the color let's just do set all for and this is for a name and we're just going to say um this is a edited embed and then um we're just going to embed dot add field and then we put a name in, we'll just put my name in, Sivo. And then we'll just put a value real quick. And we'll just do subscribe to me. We're also going to make it inline false. Incline, or incline I mean. Inline, yeah, it is inline, never mind. We'll just make that false. And then we're going to do await interaction dot response. Okay, I can't, I, there we go, I'll spell it. And then we're going to do edit underscore message. And then we're just going to put in embed, embed equals embed. 
that's not embed equals it. embed equals embed and that's literally it for that and now if we do another one if we do uh if select dot value the zero is equal to two then we can just do await interaction dot response dot edit underscore message and then we we have to do content if you're going to edit it so content content equals and then we're just going to do edited text i cannot spell to save my life and then if select dot value is equal to three then we can just simply do await interaction dot response and then dot send underscore message and we can just send hello you clicked me you licked me all right we'll do that instead and that's all you have to do we can also add emojis so we're actually going to do that so if we just do emoji we, we can just add emoji so i'm going to get emoji real quick there we go i got myself a little emoji for the edited embed just to show you that it works and now we've got to call these embeds for uh for a command which is very simple though it's literally four lines so at bot dot command and then async def and then we're just going to say menu i guess and we're going to just put in a ctx and now we just do view equals my select and then we're just going to do await ctx dot send and then we can just do hello and then we can put in view equals view now if we run this bot it should hopefully work all right now if we just do menu like that it's going to say choose an option as we've oh shit, as we put in a placeholder here so if we choose an option uh let's choose to edit an embed okay guys i realized why it weren't working because i had value it should be values and i forgot to do that and yeah so that's why i weren't working and this is just straight up spelled different now if we do menu and we choose edit his embed it's going to say it's going to add an embed above the menu so it's going to say this is an edited embed subscribe to see one got edit message which will edit the message and then we've got a normal message that will send hello you lick me and you can also do a normal message with an embed as well so guys i hope you enjoyed that is how you do um, the edited uh, select menu you can also do a few things where you can also select if you want me to do another video on this and you want to know more how to do a select menu drop a like and subscribe and i will show you majority of the stuff because it will make a very long video if i do explain it all so yeah but this is the like you know the most basic stuff on how to actually do it and get what you want